The Alabama laws now in effect prohibit groups of 10 or more from gathering together, with most houses of worship offering services online or in parking lots. But if churches insist on staying open, they'll have no fight from at least one sheriff in Alabama. Stand by my words. I'm not going to call. I'm not going to have churches. I'm not going to send a deputy into a church and tell them they got to quit having church. I'm not going to send a deputy into a business and say you got to close your business doors. So today we asked for reaction from the state's top lawmaker and law enforcer, beginning with Attorney General Steve Marshall. His office says the Attorney General agrees that enforcement of the order against churches would be ill-advised. The governor's office tells us she's been in close contact with the AG to ensure that all public health orders uphold our constitutional rights while protecting the lives of our people during this health crisis. We asked the state's top health officer about law enforcement not enforcing the laws. Dr. Scott Harris said he has no response. But Dr. Mark Wilson at the Jefferson County Department of Health had plenty to say today. Regardless of what law enforcement chooses to do, I'm gravely concerned about the potential risk to life that could result if public health orders are blatantly defied. He's urging folks to stay home and watch services remotely. In Vestavia Hills, Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.